In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to remote lock a lost or stolen Android phone. So there are basically two methods to remote lock your lost or stolen Android device. The first method involves remembering the email address which was on the lost or stolen phone along with its password. And the second method involves just putting in your phone number and locking the phone remotely. That's it. Now, in order for you to execute this, you would need to get hold of a phone or a PC that is connected to the internet. Once you do that, the first method is going to be like this. You just get to Google Chrome or the device that you get and do a search for find hub once you do that you get all the suggestions out here go ahead and uh, log in to find hub so google find hub is a place on google through which you could do a lot of things you could track loss of stolen android devices you could remote lock devices that is connected to your account on find hub you could even keep track of your friends and family members if they decide to share the live location with you you could do everything under one roof out here itself Okay, now in order for you to remote lock your loss or stolen Android device, you just get to devices, select the device that is listed out here. In order for you to get to this page, you need to use the same email address that is on the phone that you misplaced. Okay, after you do that, you get to this page, by the way. Okay, so you select the phone that you're wanting to remote lock and then you click on remote lock. Here, you just enter the phone number, click on lock device. Once a device is online, it is locked. The second method is pretty straightforward and simple. You just type in Android dot com forward slash lock and do a search you just put in your phone number click on lock device once it comes online your device is locked but it is only going to work if you had set up remote lock on your android device before it was misplaced but let me tell you this that these days most android devices come with this feature almost automatically on now what i mean by that is when you're signing up for an account on your new phone or when you're setting up your android device you may have been prompted to turn remote lock on on your Android device for your security. So just give it a try. I'm sure it's going to work for you. Give my video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. Take care, my friend.